please welcome Adrian Walsh. He's been working in America and he's been getting a lot of laughs out there. And this fellow is different because he doesn't tell Irish jokes. Will you please welcome Adrian Walsh. I hope you all had a good journey down today. I came down the uh, motorway today. I came up the M5, M4. Has anybody been on the motorway this night? Yeah. Oh, great. <laughs> Days like this, you realize why Dave Allen did his finger off. <laughs> I wasn't born here, but I think I'm going to die here. <laughs> so, if you join in, I'll only do two hours. You may dance if you wish. You don't mind me saying, sir, but you might as well laugh because you don't get any fun here. <laughs> Why do you always set up a truck? <laughs> Give him a round of applause for the dead guy down the front of the truck. Oi, 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 oi! Oh, mind you're going down by the line. I'm not surprised, but thank you. I'm going to knock you conscious. <laughs> hey, uh, and the very talented Adrian Walsh. More comedy now from a gentleman who's just completed a very successful tour of the M25. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Ireland's very own Adrian Walsh. You money to a mile, you need to be the greatest diplomat in the world, right girls? Men have got an ego as fragile as an eggshell. There's two things you must never ever say to a man. Firstly, that he is wrong. And secondly, you must never ever say to a man, why don't you pull over and ask somebody directions? <laughs> because men are the most stubborn animal on the face of this planet, right girls? I will never forget my grandfather's dying words, I'm not dipping my lights till he dips his. <laughs> and actually, I hope I've had a lot of life, thanks for your hospitality, for me and Walsh, good afternoon. Thanks a lot for